Hi, this is Mike at Design Point. I'm working in 3D via Composer, and I just want to take a minute to look at how we can manually control our BOM IDs. So if you've worked in Composer before, you're probably familiar with the BOM Workshop. And we'll go ahead and use that BOM Workshop to generate our BOM IDs based on comparing the properties of the parts or the actors. When we do that, we've automatically created all our BOM IDs, and we can go ahead and show our BOM table. However, if we select a few of our actors, and we create callouts for those, notice that the BOM IDs are not ordered sequentially because we created them based on looking at all the parts and looking at the properties rather than the position of those actors. So let's go ahead and just put these BOM IDs across the top. So at this point if I decided I wanted these BOM IDs to be ordered sequentially rather than the way that the BOM, I, that the BOM workshop created them for us, my best bet would probably be to go ahead and reset those BOM IDs but now I can use this Assign Manually button and as I click on my different parts it's going, going to go ahead and create the BOM IDs sequentially in order. The other way that we can do that is simply by clicking on one and overwriting the BOM ID property right here.